Hi everybody, welcome to Tag Grow Stocks channel. Today I present you a new episode. Specifically, I will give you five top robotic stocks for 2021. So these robotic stocks have strong momentum and they have good growth as well. And many of these strong robotic stocks just came back with the overall market. So they offer attractive price levels now. So I think it definitely pays to watch that video until the end with me and have a look at all of these strong robotics stocks. So before I start right off with the first robotics stock, I have to make a short disclaimer. This video does not constitute financial advice. It's for entertainment purposes only, so please consider that. And also one more quick note, please subscribe now to my channel with a link in the description below and hit the notifications bell so that going forward you do not miss any market leading stocks from me and also so that you do not miss part two of the top robotics stocks for 2021 which i will be releasing soon okay so that was it for the intro so let's start right off with the first robotics stock for 2021 and as you can see it in the charts it is DDD 3D systems. Here you can see the long term chart of DDD, and as you can see, 3D systems, yeah, we was a little bit sluggishly trading. Yeah, we had here a little bit trading upwards, then downwards with the moving average, a little bit upwards, and long term downtrend. So, overall, we have been trading down in DDD for quite some time, so there was no clear uptrend, especially when you look a little bit long term i think yeah since 2014 we have been in a long term downtrend in ddd and yet just recently um let's say we broke the downtrend around uh, november 2020 and formed the nice and strong uptrend you can see that as well here the moving averages the long term moving averages are stacking up quite nicely one above the other now and yeah, so we are now, we are trending in, or we moved into an uptrend from that long-term downtrend previously. And in the short-term chart, you see that as well. You see here, yeah, moving sideways. And then November strong break, or start of January here, strong breakout to the upside, strong volume coming into the stock, way strong volume. I mean, you see that here, that volume, yeah, so high. And yeah, just a strong move. I mean, we traded from around January $10 up to $56, a strong momentum move in in the DDD stock. And yeah, recently we came back together with the overall market. The NASDAQ uh, was a little bit sluggishly trading this week and last week. And yeah, we came back and now it looks like we could bounce for the 40 day. This is a 40 day moving average. We could have a bounce here or of the 50 day. So I think this price level is an attractive entry level at $36. Yeah. And before we were at $56, it's I think an excellent entry level for DDD. When we look at the growth characteristics, I mean, the EPS goes, it's strong with 182%. On the sales course, it's a little bit sluggish with minus 21%, but the relative strength rating, it's good with 88. So I think with these characteristics, 3D systems is definitely a top robotics stock for 2021. Okay, so that was it for DDD. Now let's have a look at the next top robotics stock for 2021. And it is MTLS materialize. Here you can see the long term chart of materialize, and as you can see, we have been in a long term uptrend overall since 2017. Here we traded up nicely, sideways moving phase, breakout, sideways moving phase, and then let's say around um, May 2020 could break out of that sideways moving phase and form a way strong uptrend after these two previous sideways moving faces and in the short term chart you see that uptrend here you see here we had a period of pause or base here we broke out of that pause or base and traded to the upside and recently we came heavily back and materialized and when we look here now we are trading around the 150 day moving average 
So I think a bounce could happen soon of the one or a year of the 200 day could have a bounce here to the upside and continue with that of a strong uptrend. And when we look at the gross characteristics for material lies, um, yeah, the EPS goes, it's sluggish, it's minus 220%. And so is the sales goes, it's minus 19%. But the relative strength rating, it's okay with 84. And I think it's in a hot sector in the robotic space. So I think materialize has definitely more room to run. And I think it's a good robotic stock for 2021. Okay, so that was it for materialize. Now let's have a look at the next strong robotics stock for 2021 and it is LAZR Luminar Technologies. Here you can see the long-term chart of Luminar and as you can see yeah we have been trading sideways for quite some time or since its IPO its IPO was around uh, yeah, April 2019 and why does that matter or um, in general, we look out for young companies because in the first 10 years after their IPOs, 95% um, of their super performance is happening for strong stocks. Um, so it definitely pays if you watch out for young companies because they could, when they have good growth, strong momentum and are in strong sectors or leading new theme sectors, they could have way strong performance runs so it definitely pays to watch out for such young companies and Lumina could one could be one of them um yeah we traded sideways and we had a strong break breakout starting in november 2020 strong to the upside and now we you see that in the short term chart as well strong breakout strong upside move up to 47 dollars now we came back then quickly we came back to 23 dollars and now we are kind of base building and in the recent days we came back further now trading at $27 I think that could be an attractive entry level for Lumina when we look at the growth characteristics for Lumina um, yeah these are not the greatest I mean they are around zero and um, yeah the relative strength rating I mean it's also this is not the strongest it's 36 but we because we look um for a longer term time frame but when we look here the momentum move which we which happened from november uh in november to from november to december way strong momentum move i mean we were trading around ten dollars we traded up to 47 dollars this is a way shorter momentum move so i think lumina is still a good robotics stock for 2021 okay so that was it for lumina now let's have a look at the next top robotics stock for 2021. And it is IRBT, iRobot. Here you can see the long-term chart of iRobot. And as you can see here, previously we had here, here we had a long-term downtrend lasting from around April, 2019 until we made the low in March, 2020. And we could reverse from that low trade to the upside uh, and form a nice and strong uptrend in the short term chart here you see you see an up move here you see a period of pause in that up move a base building phase and here a breakout of that base and now it looks like we're building here another base in irobot when we look at the growth characteristics for irobot um yeah the eps goes it's strong with plus 65 percent and so is the sales growth with plus 35 percent and the relative strength rating it's okay with 82 so i think with these characteristics irobot is definitely a top robotics stock for 2021 okay so that was it for irobot so now we come to the last top robotics stock for 2021 for today and it is SSYS Stratasys. Here you can see the long term chart of Stratasys, and as you can see in the long term chart, yeah, we have been in a downtrend, let's say from July 2019 until around 
yeah september september october 2020 then we reversed from the lows we broke that downtrend around november 2020 trade to the upside and we had a way strong up momentum moving straight to this in the short term chart you see that up move here strong to the upside and you can see as well short term and in the long term chart all these moving averages are stacking quite nicely to the upside now so we are trending strongly to the upside and yeah recently here you see as well in this short term chart yeah, we came back heavily in straight assist together with the nasdaq yeah. then we had the growth worries the um we had the worries uh inflation would increase too quickly but i think these worries are not justified and all these growth stocks will come back swiftly so and quickly so i think it, i think this level here for straight assist is could be an excellent entry level now we are trading at the 50-day moving average and i think we could see a bounce to the upside in straight assist and when we look at the growth characteristics for straight assist i mean the eps goes it's super strong with 1452 percent the sales goes is sluggish with minus 23 percent but the relative strength trading it's okay with 76 so I think with these characteristics, straight assist is definitely a top robotics stock for 2021. Okay, so these were the robotics stocks for 2021 for today. I hope in that video are some nice robotics stocks which you can use for your research. And also do not forget to subscribe to my channel with the link in the description below so that going forward you do not meet miss any market leading stocks for me and also so that you do not miss part two of the top robotic stocks for 2021 so please subscribe now and thank you for watching that video and i think that this year will be an exciting stock trading year with all that fiscal and monetary stimulus going on around the world from all of these central banks and governments so I think it definitely pays in if you invest your time um, to research new stocks because I think there is a lot of money to be made with these strong liquidity measures and with that of a strong liquidity in the market. I think this will propel the stock prices higher and higher and also the set prices. So I think in the end we will have very strong performances okay thank you for watching that video and i hope to see you again soon cheers